the Pleasant Grove Wastewater Treatment Plant located in West Roseville. It treats the wastewater from homes and businesses in the west part of Roseville and it is a 12 million gallon per day capacity plant. The Energy Recovery Project is a partnership between the refuse utility and the wastewater utility and we use a byproduct that's produced from the digesters that was once flared and now it creates a vehicle fuel and we fuel between 15 to 30 trucks per day with this fuel. The philosophy of resource recovery and the sustainability is important to the city and this project in that we're reusing gas for a long-term sustainable uh, purpose is really beneficial to the city. The energy recovery project was necessary to take advantage of some growth that was happening in Roseville as we were expanding the plant and to simultaneously deal with changes of regulations as it relates to high strength waste. Wastewater from the community flows into the plant and goes through the treatment process. One of those steps is anaerobic digestion, which produces methane, which is a renewable fuel. We collect the gas, we upgrade it to renewable vehicle fuel for CNG standards, pressurize it, and put it into trucks. Brown and Caldwell also designed a high strength waste facility, which intakes flats, oils, and greases that is collected from nearby restaurants around the area. That high strength waste is fed to the digesters, which helps the digesters produce a significant more amount of biogas. And that biogas helps the city fuel more trucks. The high strength waste also is a sustainable outlet for these materials that we would typically put down a drain or feed to landfills. We elected to include microturbines in this project as a way to produce renewable power and heat for the digesters as part of the project. After we fuel the trucks, we have some tail gas that we need to do something with, and that tail gas can be used in the microturbines and also power 10% of our plant with that gas. Brown and Caldwell also helped the city of Roseville secure over $7 million in funding uh, from three different agencies including the California Energy Commission, the Clean Water State Revolving Fund, and the Placer County Air Pollution Control District. The energy that's produced here is a direct drop-in replacement from our traditional fossil fuel natural gas. And what it really, the benefit it provides, it's a carbon neutral to carbon negative fuel. So we're actually fighting climate change now. We see how important this is for, for Roseville's future, our wastewater, sustainability of just the environment. Wastewater is benefiting the solid waste department and we're also using that to offset some of our use from our own Roseville Electric. So it's a great cross-utility project for the city of Roseville that benefits ratepayers in all of those areas. In Roseville we have one single goal and that's to serve our customers the most effective way that we can and if that means operating in our utilities in a way that they work compatibly with one another to create value and reduce costs for our customers, that's what we want to be doing.